Uh, this is kind of interesting. I've never seen this before. Uh, it looks like there's a little clearing in the middle of the canes. And it seems as though something has used this to bed down. I'm not sure why. But it looks like it's cleared out about maybe 20 feet in diameter. Okay, I've kind of looked around all I need to for right now. Um, like I said, I probably disturbed um, the area. Walking around inside of it, putting my scent and all those things you don't want to do um, when you're looking for something. Um, I may have ruined a spot that uh, I could have observed uh, instead of uh, getting in the middle of it. But I guess those are trial run type things. But uh, I'll just uh, check back into this area. I don't want to do uh, too much hanging around inside this thicket. Kind of gives me this. Uh, little uneasy feeling that uh, something could uh, uh, bum rush me real quick. You never know. So anyway, I'll check back and uh, I'll just keep you informed. Okay, I've just left the uh, bedding area that I had found in the canes that was 20 feet in diameter. Uh, this same cane area is adjacent to uh, the area I'm getting ready to go into. What I'm getting ready to do is check a series of caves on the side of the hill. Uh, to truly see if they are black bear caves or something more than that. Uh, now that it's getting to be spring, it'd be a good time to observe whether or not, uh, you know, bears are coming out of hibernation. Uh, this is an area that I've researched for a couple years and have revisited several times and uh, have filmed shapes and images that uh, I could not duplicate or explain. So today we're going to get a little bit closer in and uh, look for movement and uh, at this time uh, the narration will, uh, will discontinue the narration at this time.
this is 31U and it's been two hours later and I'm getting ready to leave the area it doesn't look like we had too much activity on the hillside with the bear caves today um, but uh, it gives us some new footage and a new awareness of uh, the area that I'm exploring and uh, Feel free to comment, uh, leave uh, time frames if you think you've spotted something I might have overlooked. I always appreciate that. And uh, maybe next time we'll have better luck and more movement and uh, something new to report. But uh, I'll keep you informed anyway. And um, I'll kind of condense this uh, video into the shortest version that I can in a two hour time frame but uh, anyway I uh, hope you enjoyed and uh, thanks a lot for viewing have a nice day